what is up what is up y'all i want to talk about in this video today about the idea and inspiration for my home server uh from a visual perspective as i've been watching this show on netflix called abstract and it just inspired me so much that i felt that i couldn't i possibly couldn't just get a a regular case, PC case, and just slap my home server in it, and, and that will be it. No, I can't do that. I can't do that. It has to be. It has to be something iconic. It has to be something iconic. It has to mean something because this time, I mean it. I mean the home server. I was, I did a couple home servers before on Raspberry Pis and all that. I never. It never. It was never a production thing. It was never stable. It was never good. But this time. That's what I want to do. I want to make it good. I want to make it stable. I want to make it production. I want to make it something that that I trust. You know what I mean? And it deserves all the love it can get and all the work it can get because it's going to serve me well for the next couple of years. A good couple of years. So yeah. But then the other issue is that I don't have a lot of space in my new apartment. It's a small apartment, right? I don't have a lot of space. And I didn't want to really use any of the quote unquote hiding space to put the server in because it's, I, I, I will have put in so much work. I want to display it. I want to put it out in the world. Yes, here it is. You know what I mean? And I trust it. And that's a good dude right there. He's doing his job very well, you know? And so, I want to display it. Let me just check my mic. I'm having to have, like, headphones that have microphones and record on my phone. And then the camera records the audio because I don't have a, a level ear mic or anything. <laughs> and it's hella echoey here, as you can see. Sorry for that. <laughs> yeah, it's getting sorted out. But long story short, um, home server, right? I will put it somewhere on display, right next to my TV. Here's my TV. There, I'm actually, I'm actually show you it right like that. So there's a TV, and the home server is gonna go right over yonder where the router is right now. That is where the home server is gonna go. It's gonna be an iconic piece. And uh, my bad. Oh, check this plant out. I see that it's coming in there. Ooh, that's a good view right there. Check that out. I love that. Okay, that's going to be it. That is going to be it. Amen. The PC case for my home server, Tripper, has to be something iconic. It has to be a piece of art. And this is what I stumbled onto. This is what I stumbled up onto. Check this out. So here's my Pinterest board because I've been using Pinterest a lot and it's great. I stumbled upon this shape. I stumbled upon this shape. This is an infinity cube. That's what it's called. And I just fell in love with it because I know I had these notes. Let me show you my notes. I had these drawings of, of these shapes. Originally wanted an L. Just started drawing, you know. I just started drawing. And then also came up with maybe like a like a like a boxy design of this 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 sledge design. Or maybe a complete just brick, just a big brick. And then I stumbled upon this. I stumbled upon this shape and it just, poof, I need it right away, right away. This is what I want. I knew it right away. This is what I want. So it, this is gonna be the case for the ba ba da ba da. This is going to be the case for the for my home server, Tripper. This is going to be the case for Tripper. Now, how it's going to get solved is, for example, you see on this, the PC insides, the computer itself, will be pointing inwards, right? And there will be pieces of um, metal welded, like here, on the corners and here in the big corner in the back for the here for the motherboard 
and here for like the the power supply down here will be a big fan just pushing air upwards right and hard drives here somewhere hard drives will be mounted somewhere I'm not sure and i'm in a very lucky position where my dad can make this without a single problem <laughs> my dad is a he's a welder welder so yeah he's just gonna make this for me and i'm very happy about that <laughs> thanks dad and but for the outside so this is this is the inside this is going to be the the skeleton of the thing and everything will be mounted inside nice and easy for the outside there will be metal sheets so there will be a metal sheet on this side on this side and then on the top right, this this side and then on the top about the back i'm not sure i'll see doesn't really matter but the two front sides and the top will have a metal sheet on there a rectangular metal sheet and they will be mounted with magnets of course because that's fucking cool <laughs> that's just fine. like that's just straight up cool <laughs> and they will be removable very easily and they will be just metal sheets and overarching exactly where the two pieces meet on the top and in the front overarching exactly so that the pieces inside cannot be seen but there's still a half an inch or a centimeter gap so when you look at it it looks like it's just it's empty like w w what's going on what is what's going on here like you can't see in it but you see that it's open but there's nothing in it because it's going to be pitch black inside pitch black there's going to be it's going to be pitch black and that's going to be so cool and on top of this so this is the hardware side of things this is the technical side of things right but now we're getting more into the art piece which i really just want the art piece is gonna come from is gonna come from some a friend of mine or i'm not sure who that person will be but a friend of mine somebody or even multiple people after each other um, will paint. I will ask them to paint the case. I will ask them to paint the case. And it will... I live in Berlin, so there's art everywhere. <laughs> there's art literally everywhere. I, I'm very happy the synergy between me moving to Berlin and this idea. I think this idea actually will spark because of that. There's just... There's just art. I love this city. Anyways, this is something what I'm, what I'm thinking. And this is the first time I actually Google this, this phrase, modern art. Maybe something like that. Check that out. Ooh, that's hella cool. Just imagine one of the sides of the PC being this frame or this frame and then the other and then the top. Ooh, just imagine that. That is hella cool right there. I'm going to take a screenshot of that. Right like that. Or check this out. This is beautiful too. If you can separate something like this or even just cross. So yeah. Boy, damn, check that out. This is so cool. This is so cool. Or look at that. <laughs> and this is gonna be my home server. This is gonna be the style of the painting of my home server. I'll probably have I'll probably have it this year it will be one painting and then the next year I will find I will I will meet somebody who I really like and then and then and they're really good painters and then just ask them hey would you be down to paint my art piece PC case my home server and then of course this on the inside sheets and then on the on the outside sheets and on the inside of the the tubes it's gonna be the same maybe even two different artists so that's just yeah maybe even two different artists and then see how they can contrast without knowing without oh that would be so cool that would be so cool because they have the same kind of idea they know what it is for and i'll just tell them hey paint whatever whatever you think just paint whatever you think and then it's going to be done two artists one is going to be a painting on the inside and then the outside and they'll know of course that that's the outside and that's the inside and they'll know about each other the, the, the other one will paint will be something else but 
Damn, it's a good idea right there, ain't it? So, inside, I showed you the insides. I showed you the outsides. And yeah, that's about it. This is gonna be my home server. This is only this this video is about the visual part. I'll make another video about the insides of the cur my of my current ideas of the insides because no, actually I'll talk about it right here. So I want to run Unraid because as I said probably before, I'm running out of my patience. Not my patience. I'm hitting Raspberry Pi limits. Which is completely understandable. I'm hitting Raspberry Pi limits and I can't do this on a Raspberry Pi anymore. And I want to upgrade. I want something beefy. I want something more capable. So this server is going to be a proper PC. It's going to be running Unraid. Um, which is a virtualization. It's, it's, a, it's a NAS solution with Docker built in and all those bells and whistles. It's really good. It's really good. I've always wanted to run that for longer periods of time. I always liked Unraid. Um, and it's going to be an AMD build because I on like, I don't know about the performance between those cheaper PC CPUs because it's going to be like a hundred, it's going to be the, the, the bottom tier CPU something because I don't need that much processing power on there to be honest and why, you know, um, it's probably going to be a Ryzen 3. I don't know the difference in performance, like the 10 or 5% difference between an Intel 10100, i3 10100, and a Ryzen 3 uh, 2200. Maybe like this, maybe like this, but it doesn't matter. It's the same. I just like AMD. That's the thing. I just like AMD. And I want to build something with AMD because I fucking like AMD. AMD is dope. They're coming out, they're making great progress changing the game hell yeah that's all i'm saying that's all i'm saying hell yeah so it's going to be an amd build um also something just a regular motherboard this is this is as much as i'm saying i want this to be stable it will be upgraded because i need this quite urgently but i don't necessarily have the financial means or even i could but i don't want to spend that much money on a top of the line server with proper Ryzen 7, even maybe a graphics card and then pass through gaming on that. That will probably be what uh, Tripper will end up being, but not right now. So right now, just start easy, start slow. Um, yeah, AMD build, AMD, not a bunch of RAM, maybe 16. Yeah, probably go with 16. Just, you know, our regular regular stuff. And then some and then some not drives. NAS drives preferably, although not sure, NAS drives. And yeah, that's going to be it. That's is my plan, current plan because it keeps changing every week. But I think this is this is a solidified plan. It was marinated and it's a sol solid plan. Um for Tripper, for my home server. Oh, one more thing that I forgot is that the CPU will be passively cooled, or if I can find a very, very, very quiet fan. One, one with a very quiet fan, because it's gonna be on 24 seven, and it's gonna be an open enclosure. I'm gonna put uh, noise dampening foam on the insides of the, the cover sheets, so that there's not more no so that there's a bit less noise and but i still just want it to be very silent i actually wanted to go to, for a complete fanless build but the, the the prices for those that for for the prices for the hardware the price for the hardware that i would trust with a fanless solution is at least four times higher so that's not happening right now. It will have then a big fanless CPU cooler, which is gonna be pointing this direction, so, so vertically. And there's going to be a big, big, big um, be quiet or knock to a fan on the bottom that is just blowing air up, inspired by the Xbox Series X. <laughs> it is, that, that's what they're doing and it's working out for them. So, 
And that's what the, the, the Mac Pros did, the trash cam ones, and it worked out really well for them as well. There was no overheating. So that's what I'm gonna do. And then for, for the power supply, I think it's just gonna be a be quiet. Those, those, are, those are very quiet anyways. If the fan's not, then I'll just, I don't know. I'll dampen it, take out the voltage. I don't know. It's not gonna overheat, that's the thing. It's not gonna overheat. I'm gonna be using a, a, lot, a very low amount of power. So it's gonna be very quiet. That's, that's the plan, to be very, very quiet. Shouldn't even hear it at all. <laughs> all right, that's it for me, for my home server. See you later, I guess.